As students enjoy their last few weeks of summer break, Bibb County teachers are already getting ready for the first day of school. Pepper Baker joins us live from Howard High School to show you what's happening to prepare for the new school year. Frank and Lori, as you can see, there's not much going on here now, but come tomorrow morning, this place will be packed with 270 teachers and employees for Bibb County's new teacher orientation. My initial reason for becoming a teacher was because of the representation um, aspect of teaching. Everett Reese got a teaching job right after graduating from Morehouse College. Being from Macon, the Bibb County School District was at the top of his list. It's always been a dream of me and my friends um, to come back to Macon and to be a part of the solution. You know, so many of the people that come from Macon say they want to just leave and that doesn't help us. You know, there's so many kids that were in our same situation. We have to come back and help them out. He'll start his teaching career teaching seventh grade math at Howard Middle School. Human Resource Coordinator Melanique Floyd is helping him and other new teachers get ready. They will be learning um, our program, Get Better Faster, how to welcome their students into their classrooms. I'm expecting to learn uh, more about lesson planning. Uh, just any tips that veteran teachers have. Ashley O'Tyson is also a new teacher fresh out of graduate school and had experience within the Houston County school system. I've been living in Perry my entire life. I just moved to Bibb County last week. So um, I'm getting integrated into the community and I'm excited to learn more about the way Bibb does things. It kind of makes the first day jitters a little less um, frightening um, for them. Definitely having these like three days is going to, you know, prepare me a little bit more than I would have been <laughs> otherwise. So that's good. Floyd says they're looking to fill 50 p teaching positions ranging from elementary school all the way up to high school and they're definitely still in need of some special education teachers. Live in Macon, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. Thank you, Pepper. Houston County Schools are welcoming about 200 new teachers this school year.